when I was young, I was just a regular boy. I was not, um, uh, you know, the smartest kid in the class or the dumbest one either in the class. I was just a regular, average uh, boy, and I'm, I'm an average guy. Um, I was very lucky. I grew up in the midst of uh, extraordinary parents, and I was able to be given the tools to move into and try to realize my dreams. I came to the United States from Costa Rica. This is my home. My home country was Costa Rica. And I came here in search of the American dream, just like many others do. And uh, I found it. And um, I hope that others will too. When I was little, I used to play astronaut in a box, in a cardboard box in my house. And we had um, chairs uh, laying on flat on their backs. And I would get in there with my friends and my cousins and we would go on a space flight. We would go and explore other planets and find other beings. Um, I was actually on the space shuttle Columbia once um, getting ready for liftoff and it reminded me of that scene in the box and I felt that I had already done this before. This is uh, one of the most interesting feelings uh, I had uh, while I was waiting for, 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 for liftoff in, in, in the shuttle. When I came to the U.S., uh, I faced the, uh, <coughs> the same challenges that every immigrant faces. You have to learn the language. I didn't speak English. And usually, uh, there's not enough money. So you have any money. And language, money, being in a completely different culture, uh, dealing with uh, discrimination, perhaps, uh, some level of it. And, uh, and all of these things are workable. And little by little, you just get educated and uh, learn to be part of this society and, and contribute to it. 